That's feedback. Good to see you guys. Tom Mills here. Uh, it's it's getting close to Easter, and I'm out of days to do things. So I have so many things that we need to do. I need to do our monthly shopping. I need to edit the monthly shopping. I need to do. I need to bake a big Jello mold thing. A bunch of Jello eggs. Need to stuff the eggs. Um, I need to. There's like three more things, and I can't even remember what they are. But there's so many things. I just didn't go to Magic tonight, and I thought I would do this. I would get the Easter baskets things put together, and um, stuff the eggs, and get ready for Easter. So we got to dye eggs. Um, yeah. Hey there, happy Easter to you guys too. Yeah, it's very busy right now. Anyways, I'm going to go ahead and dive back in right in on this. So we can get, I can get done. Uh, I like hanging out with you guys, but I also just want to get done. So <sighs> things have been stressful and I'm not all that doing that good. Uh, anyways. Alrighty. Well, so I wasn't going to do Easter baskets and then I just decided I'd do Easter baskets. So, um, as you guys know, we kind of been collecting those plastic tubs that you get. We use them for Halloween buckets. We use them for, um, there's those little cheap Walmart ones. Um, you can get them in lots of colors. And of course, all of our kids, we have organizational colors. Um, so Andrea had been saving over years, um, trying to find different colors of all the buckets for the kids as colors. That was their Easter baskets and their Halloween candy baskets. It was always hard to find green um, than Eden's for yellow. Um, and we finally found them. Um, and then we never found an Eden one until later. And then, of course, we used acetone and got all the you know weird writing and pictures on them. Made them solid color. Andrea had printed out on her Cricut name tags and everything. And they were really nice. But Hannah didn't have one. And um, and then Solomon broke his. And I finally found a yellow one for Eden instead of the pink one that we had been using because we couldn't find a yellow one and they're kind of falling apart and they're also kind of small and so i guess what i'm getting at is i decided to go different route with the baskets so i also decided i'm not going to easter baskets for all the kids i didn't get easter baskets when i was 20 years old so um i'm just going to get candy for the bigger kids and then i'm going to do easter baskets for solomon sophia claudia hannah so all the little kids. Um, darn it. I don't know if you guys saw on the notifications. Um, some people didn't get the notification. Let's see here. Um, is it live? It's on the right channel. Yeah, it is. It's on the right channel. Okay. Sometimes I'll stream for a long time to my old channel and, um, there's hardly any people on there and yeah. So anyways, I guess what I was getting at is I got new baskets because I saw these and they were really cool. Um, so these ones here, you can see them. They're really bright colored and they got wood inside. They're pretty nice looking. Andrea would have absolutely approved. 
Um, and they didn't have lots of colors, but they did have pink and blue. So the girls are going to get pink, and uh, Solomon's going to get blue. House is quiet tonight. Um, it's a lot louder than you might think. This uh, headset that I'm using right now for my mic has really good noise canceling. So you can't hear all the hubbub in there. Um, I wanted to be away. They're just doing chores and stuff, and there's still a lot of stuff going on. I don't want the kids to see what I was doing and didn't want to interfere with chores. So that's why I'm in my bedroom. So... All right, so I think I'm just going to get started on this, so good. I'm going to get the name, the tags off of these things. All righty, so I'm going to get the four baskets here. Let's see if I can scoop back a little bit. Pink. Let's see if you guys can see all of them. Pink, pink. Blue, pink. Okay. Oh, okay. So I got some Easter grass, you know, that terrible stuff that gets stuck in the vacuum cleaner. Well, the light is just not good right here. I'm going to put this over here. I don't know if that's any better. I don't know if it's any better or not. Anyways, I got some of that paper grass. I don't know if you can see it, but it's uh, crinkled up paper which is a little less annoying to me than the uh, counterpart of the plastic stuff. So each one's going to have their own bag of paper grass. <sighs> it's been rough lately. You guys tired in general? I am ready for things to change or something. I'm missing my other things of grass. I'm starting to freak out all of a sudden. Those are definitely eggs. That's candy. Candy. Uh oh. Oh. Phew. Here we go. Yeah, you, I don't know how well you can see them on the. Uh, on the, on the camera, um, I'm going to put the laptop thing back. I can angle it better. But they're really bright pink, which I always love. Really bright colors. Neon colors are my favorite. I always secretly love neon pink, even though boys aren't supposed to love neon pink. But it's just so bright. I'm sure a lot of people are old enough to remember when neon colors came out. Do you remember that? Well, all of a sudden... There was this new thing called neon colors, and they were so bright, and I could not believe how bright they were. I immediately loved them all. Okay, so again, I got three for the girls, uh, Solomon, Sophia, Claudia, Hannah, and the rest of the kids aren't getting Easter baskets. Um, they are going to find eggs with us, and they're going to dye eggs with us, and I'm going to give them some candy, uh, but baskets are not for them. So... Um, I'm just going to randomly start going through some of this stuff before I get to the Easter eggs. So, I got kind of some customized stuff for everybody. So, Sophia is my stuffed animal lover in our house. 
but you also know we have a small house. We don't have a lot of room for stuffed animals. We've had already cut down our collection quite a bit. And so for Valentine's Day, I had given um, little heart heart things. Did I ever show them to you guys? I don't remember. But I got her a Sour Patch Kid heart candy thing. And it came with a little tiny mini plushie of a Sour Patch Kid. And she loves it. And it's, it's certified, it serves all the purposes. It gets a stuffed animal. doesn't take a lot of room. It's cute. And so I got these little things for her. The little bunnies. And I thought they'd be really good for sitting in the nest. So they're like little peeps. Hanging out here. She's going to love them. So, going to get those for her. Uh, I'm just going to go as I, I grab stuff here. So, this is a, uh, a bubble wand thing, a bubble gun. Hannah will love this. It's pink. It's her color. I thought about getting all the kids one of these, and then I decided I want to do more customized stuff, not get everybody the same thing. Oh, man, this is a zip tie. That crazy. What are they using zip ties? I should probably put batteries in it, because then that's the first thing she's going to ask. Do I want to do that now? No, I just don't want to do it now. So it's a little cute bubble wand. You put bubbles in the bottom and, uh, yeah, and some bubble solution. So that's going to be in Hannah's basket. Um, I guess I'll put it like that. There's some bubble solution in it. That's a good Friday and no meat on this day. Oh, that's not my style. In fact, I made steak for for dinner. <laughs> oh, um, okay, let me tear these off. These are some cute little water bottles. There's a yellow ducky water bottle, a blue ducky water bottle, and a pink ducky water bottle. Those are for... The little girls. Our whole top bunk is full of stuffed animals. Yep, it seems like a lot of little girls, a lot of kids go through that. Let's see, Hannah's is pink. Uh, no, Hannah's pink. Um, Sophia's is blue. And Claudia just gets the yellow one because there wasn't a purple. I've got anything for Solomon yet. So this is a big glider, foam glider. Solomon loves putting together planes that fly. It's not really going to do a good job of fitting in his basket. So, yeah. I guess I can make that work. Just like that. More zip ties. Crazy people. What happened to twist ties? Who decided the zip ties is a thing? This one's not small enough. I don't know if I can break it. Nope. I, I got a pocket knife down here. No, I don't. Maybe over there. Oh, man. I don't want to have to get up. Got one. It was fun shopping. Ow. So this is apparently a light up jump rope. Oh yeah. And this is the kind of thing Claudia will love. 
So this is for Claudia. Monthly shopping video. I haven't even done the monthly shopping video yet. I was going to do it today, and I thought maybe I'll do it Saturday. But Saturday is going to be all day baking Jello and doing Easter Easter painting eggs and all that stuff. And Sunday, I thought about maybe doing it Sunday evening. I know it's Easter, but I mean, let's all face it. Easter stops by about two, three o'clock, and Easter's over. So Easter evening might be fair game for doing shopping. I hope my mom feels better soon. Okay, so these are just some silly little uh, popper things. You squeeze them and they shoot little foam balls. Um, they're kind of beastery, kind of cute, kind of in Solomon's wheelhouse. So they're going to go in Solomon's basket. I wanted them to have some kind of characters, but probably birds weren't going to do it. And there's a little mini one. So those dudes will be inside of there, and I'll just put these in there. Hope he doesn't think they're candy. Yep, you must have missed it when we were talking earlier about that. But yeah, just four baskets. I'm not. I only got baskets for the little kids. I got candy. Actually, I got all the big kids. Got a Ferro Rocher um, bunny. So, and this doesn't look like a lot. These are like twenty bucks. So, they all got one of those. In fact, I'm just going to put this whole bag of those down. Um, let's see. Well, I got this, so this is probably going to be messy, but uh, this is that liquid chalk, and it's got a little paint roller for liquid chalk. The girls have been painting hopscotch things out on the sidewalk, so I thought maybe this will be a good idea, maybe it won't. So I'm going to put a blue, blue sidewalk chalk in Sophia's, pink one in Hannah's. I'll do it like that. And then this will be Claudia's, I guess. What else do the big kids get besides candy? And that's all they get. When you're an adult, you don't always get a lot of Easter baskets and stuff. So, um, yeah. They just get the candy. Okay, I got this for you know who, Solomon, the Lego 3-in-1, boy, the light is just not good here. It's a Lego 3-in-1 bike thing. This is more expensive than any of these other toys, um, but I know he'll love it, and I had a harder time finding stuff for him. It seems like Easter is meant for little girls as far as what things are available. Um, I think I need to move this stuff around again. He is a Lego king, so I'll put that in there like that. And then these little dudes off to the side. And the balls right there. The girls got more things, but Solomon stuff is more expensive. Okay. Okay, and these are, I hope I got them all in here. I got enough for all of them, but these are little eggs. So this is a, a little egg with M&Ms in it. And there's one with, uh, one with Skittles. One with Oreos. 
And one more. What's the other one? Oh. One with Sour Patch Kids. So I'm going to put those little four eggs in there. And Oreo, 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 Skittles, 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 M&M's, M&M's. M&M's, Sour Patch Kids, Sour Patch Kids, Sour Patch Kids. Okay, good. They're all there. Uh, thank you, guys. Okay, so I wasn't going to put these in the Easter basket, but then I thought maybe I can just put, maybe I should just roll them up and put them in there. So I got some Easter dresses. You saw that probably on the thumbnail. And I was looking at different ones, and they happen to have the colors for each of the girls. So this is a little pink dress for Hannah. So I think what I'll do is fold it in half like that and roll it up nice and tight. Do I want to do that? They're already getting pretty full. It's going to be weird if I just stuff them in here. Um... Hmm. Let's see, maybe if I roll this fluffy dress a little better. Um. Okay, all right. That's that's a little better. All right, so let me see. Um, man, I don't know. Can I? Okay, one Easter dress. You have that flower dress you're wearing for church on Sunday. Oh, that's fun. So this one's a Claudia one. It's just a purple version. It's got some starry things on the bottom. But it's basically the same dress. Fold that in. Fold that stuff together. Okay, purple dress, loaded. Um, blue dress for Claudia or for Sophia. That's her color. It's got some blue and pinkish little stripes, kind of gypsy-ish, on the bottom. I don't know why I said gypsy-ish, but it reminds me of a gypsy dress. Okay, let's see. Fold that maybe in. It's been harder to buy clothes for Eden. I'm a dad. I'm not cool. And so you get a teenage girl... And they kind of respect the opinions of other teenage girls or other women, but uh, they don't really. And uh, plus, sizing is scary. Okay, so, but I did get Eden a yellow blouse. I don't know if you can see that okay. A yellow blouse so she can have yellow to wear that's her organizational color and I think it will fit I hope that it will and I hope that she likes it so that's what I get for gambling oh thank you I hope it works out ok 
Okay. I know this is kind of overlapping Solomon's other gift, but it's a glider that shoots with a slingshot. And he loves airplanes that fly and launch and stuff. That's why I got him a little rocket set. He's been loving that little stomp rocket I got him for Christmas. He takes it everywhere when we go to the park. Um, okay, then I needed some just some candy for the... Oh, I still got these. So... So this is a little pet. I just saw these. I thought they were cute. They're uh, little Pez collections. It has a bunch of the Pez candy at the bottom and a little East pink Easter rabbit for the Pez dispenser. And then for Solomon, he's got a little gray mouse a rat. Depending on which is cooler, I suppose. So I guess I can put this one here. Mouse should be looking forward. There we go. Dang it, I could have put that in the middle of the dress. Um, this is only the second year I've ever done Easter baskets. I never did them before. So I'm more emboldened to do things I've never done now that I'm a single dad. And I know I'm not going to measure up to the things Andrea could do. And so I try to just stick with what I know. This is the kind of thing I was good at. Andrea always had me buy candy for their stockings because I would go through all the trouble to pick out special candies and stuff. And I can buy things, and I'm good at picking things out, but I, uh, I'm not. I can. I'm kind of crafty at heart, but I don't have the time to be crafty. And I didn't have as strong of a desire to do it as Andrea did. So these may not have their names on the baskets, but. They're cool. Uh, so these are some more of those Ferro Rocher. And uh, those are just the candies. And the kids all love these. They're like big hits at our house. I guess they're hazelnut. I like them a lot too. I made the mistake the other day when I was buying these. I bought one of those giant ones. And I thought it was just going to be a gimmick, and there was going to be these things inside of a plastic shell. But it was just a giant one, and it was not as good at all. It was just some chocolate. There was just some chocolate with some stuff in it. Oh, this is annoying me right here. What does Justice think of his picture in the paper? He didn't like it, of course. He says, oh, it's such a cringy picture. Look at my face. And I was like, well, you're running as hard as you can. The other guy running next to you on, on top had a cringy face, too. It's like it's, you, can't, you can't run and have a photogenic face if you're running as hard as you can. 100-meter dash. All right, so how many do I got here? 3, 6, 9, 12, 24 divided by 4. That's an even number, 6 each. Um, shoot. My other baskets are pretty crowded. 1, 2. Maybe I won't put all... Let's see, I guess I can stack these eggs a little higher. Five. Six. Oh, 
Uh, thank you, Ursula. Thank you, Helen. Hey there, Jasmine. Uh, let's see. I'm going to stack those like that. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I can stack the eggs up a little more and just dump those all there. Move that back there. the last thing I got for their baskets I just got these the other day because I couldn't resist is the Cadbury cream eggs um, these aren't my favorite at all I actually I hate them um, but they were Andrea's favorite that's what she waited for Easter for was to have these and so I figure to keep the tradition going a little bit this one's got a little goo coming out of it that's not good just pick it off there, right? Okay, so one, 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 one. This one I'll put on Andrea's grave. I put one there last year and it stayed there for quite a while until it melted and then the ants ate all of the chocolate, so... Well, thank you guys for that, and I think they are pretty good. It looks pretty nice. Of course, I'm not ready for them yet, so I'm going to have to put them over on my dresser. And cover them with a blanket. Okay, one... You think they'll figure out whose is whose? Or should I tell them? I think I'll have to tell them. And they might see the pink. And this one's got mostly blue in it. They'll probably think that's Sophia's. They'll probably figure it out. They'll have fun trying, I guess. They'll figure the blue one is Solomon's, I'm sure. I'm going to put this blanket. Over it. There we go. Okay, I guess you might as well want to see the rest of the stuff I got, even if this is for tomorrow. And I'm not doing anything with it. You guys might want to look at it. Anyways. I'm going to end up stepping on these bunnies of candy. Put them up here. I heard that, Julie. That's pretty crazy. What a fun coincidence. Marrying Optimus Prime. Okay, so there's some stuff I got just for Easter. I, I kind of had a little panic attack when I checked out with this Easter stuff, and it was like $250 of Easter stuff, which was like, <clears throat> but it's best I can do. I can't do all the special things, but I can, I can buy stuff. So, okay. So this is a uh, volcano that you can put an egg in. And I'm assuming it's got um, little pellets of, 
uh, baking soda. I somehow got two of these. I don't remember if I was thinking, oh yeah, they might need to do it twice. I don't, I don't know. Two different kids, two different sides of the table. I don't know. But I got two of them. So this is for dying eggs. And then I got two of these egg mazing things. Have you guys seen these? You put your egg on them and it spins them. And you just grab little markers and you can draw and it makes lines on them. Which I was doing before there was a machine to do it. I made this cool little thing for my drill. And was and eggs would fit inside of there and I could spin it and make all kinds of fun things with it. And... Now there's an official thing for it, so I figured they'd fight over them, so I got two. And then I got a set of these markers, and I this is important because I don't know if this will be the same, but we've always colored markers with uh, Sharpies on our Easter eggs, but there's something with the coating of an egg that messes with Sharpies. And it starts to work, and then it starts to eat away the Sharpie, and then it doesn't write very good anymore. And so um, I'm hoping, that since these are egg markers, that they will uh, work better for eggs. So we're going to do the thing on his drill and use markers. You're so much fun. We also use the fake cardboard eggs. They work really good. Yep, yep. I was so proud of myself. I've done, I had that years ago. You can actually go back and watch some of Andrew's old vlogs and watch me use it. It's there somewhere. All right, so that's some of the Easter egg stuff I got. And then this is a whole bunch of dye kits. So as I told you, I'm a neon fan, so these are all the neon colors. And the last time... I, uh, it's really hard to tell the difference between the, the orange color dye tabs and the red and the purple. Um, but I got three of them. Last time I, I linked them together and I put double the concentration, two tabs, into one thing. And it made them so bright and amazing. It was so cool. So this time I got three. Three of the uh, neon ones, I thought. Yeah, three in the neon ones here, so I can triple that up and see how that comes out. Uh, we got a tie dye. I'm sorry that the lighting is just not good right there. I should have brought in another light. So tie dye, egg thing, a marble, egg dye kit, um, whatever a pop party is. Looks like some has some sleeves. 24 karat gold one. Uh, candy shiny egg one. And then I got these. I'm going to try something interesting. I'll show you on the video if it works out. It might be stupid. But I got these little marshmallows that are shaped like ice cream cones. And I'm going to be cutting the tops off of them to try something. So if it works, it works. You'll see it. Otherwise, you won't see it. So... Um, yeah. Good mood this light, yeah. What did you get for the golden egg? I kind of panicked again. I keep buying eggs every year. But I keep thinking, I think they're, I still, old ones are in the attic. And I think, what if they're not? And so I end up just buying new ones. So the gold eggs, I got actually gold eggs. So I haven't decided exactly what I'm going to do here. So I got these pastel eggs for the girls. Each one has two of each color in it. And of course, since our organizational colors are all rainbow colors, that works great. That means there's two blue ones here, like for Sophia, four, six, eight, 10, 12. So they'll all have a dozen eggs in their color, and they'll only be allowed to find those eggs. So that way we can hide the pink ones for Hannah easier than the blue ones for Sophia, and then continue the difficulty. So 
Um, I have to decide what I want to eat. And, to be, and, of course, I got some for all the kids. I want all the kids to be able to find some eggs. I know my kids are old, and I have boys that are 20 years old, but 22. Thomas is, tw Thomas is 22? Yeah, I think he is. Anyways, um, but it's it's a memory that I don't want. I'm not ready to let go yet. So uh, there's this one golden egg here, but I've gotten a couple other ones. I don't know where they are. There'll be some money in them. Oh, here's another golden egg. Then again, I might just use these golden eggs here. And um, in the past, I had a metallic egg in, for each kid to find. Then I thought maybe I'll go back to just one golden egg that's big, like this one. But since Eden's a girl, she'd be in the girl-colored eggs, which means this the yellow metallic gold ones could be available. And I could, of course, I could hire, I could hide 12 just gold eggs and just make them just random whoever finds them. Um, yeah, I, th I, th I think too, Tara. And it's, it's silly and silly. Of course, I'm out there hiding the eggs. And Andrea would do stuff like that for me sometimes. And the eggs, I always hid the eggs. But, um, Sometimes she would include me in the silly kid games, and it was always fun. And I know the kids would like it. And those kinds of memories will always be in their head. Finding the golden egg. They always tell me the stories of every year when Camden used to always find the golden eggs, or their cousin, or you know, when that one time when Dad hid it um, inside of a pipe and nobody found it. And you know, and that one time, it's just like they're just all good memories. So. You forget where you hide them sometimes? Well, we know there's 12 of each, so these days, they almost all get found. It's pretty rare they don't get found. So. <sighs> well, let's start little at a time here, I suppose. Do I want to go kid by kid? No, I want to go candy variety by candy variety. So I got some marshmallow peeps. I thought it'd be fun to stuff them in eggs. Um, the sour watermelon peeps are so good. But besides the sour watermelon peeps, peeps are just basically gross as far as I'm concerned. So let's see, 4, 8, 10, 12. Oh. Is that right? Well, there's 10 chicks in each. 20. So I can make everybody have a watermelon peep. And I can eat a couple while I'm sitting here. How many eggs do you color? When people see, I bought them on the thing, so it's all kind of, we've always gotten differently. Sometimes I got, I think we got three 18s, three 18 eggs in the past, so how many is that? Uh, 18, 36, uh, uh, 54. Uh, it's enough for each kid to die, like only like four or five eggs, which is sad. So this year, I got, I don't remember how many I got. I might have gotten, I don't I think I got five or six dozen. Marshmallows belong four places. Rice Krispie Squares, PB Rocky Road, Hot Chocolate, and S'mores. That's it. <laughs> uh, I agree with that, I think. Rocky Road, yeah, absolutely. Rice Krispie Squares, absolutely. Hot Chocolate, yes. S'mores, yes. I like these, though. I like sour candy. And these are sour watermelon, so... Um... Okay, I guess I can just open one pack of each. But the metallic ones are so much cooler than the other ones. But we need separate colors for the girls. So 
I love metallic colors. Metallic and neon colors. You get me some metallic neon something, and I will be your best friend. Um, okay, let's see. So I won't need all of them. So I need Thomas Asher Judah. Actually, Thomas, I'm not, I don't think he's going to be here. He's, we're going to see him for lunch, but I don't think he's going to be here for the Easter egg hunt. He wants to sleep in. So don't need the blue ones. Um, Asher, Judah, Judah gets stuck with pink a lot of times, Justice, Eden will be the yellow ones, Eden, Solomon will be these two greenish eggs, Solomon, Sophia, Claudia, Hannah. Which means I don't need these orangish eggs and these reddish eggs. And I'll save these golden ones for the end. So I'm going to get screwed up if I'm not careful here. So, All right, so I'm going to go ahead and eat one of these right now. Oh, yeah, they're, they're pretty tasty. So it's mostly the coating that's tasty. But that's all I can eat. I actually can't stand stuff that's too sweet. Okay. Oh, man. I don't... <laughs> I'm not going to get a peep in here. No, well, maybe I will. I guess it works out. It's going to be <laughs> just a mess of marshmallow. Okay, so... Those are trash ones. I guess I did Claudia. I need to lose this track here, so I better start over. Let's see. Uh, let's go in order. Asher. The Martian piece after the day they get stale. Yeah, when they're a little hard. I think that's because they were always hard when we were kids, right? It's kind of like uh, red vines. Red vines have got to be a little snappy. You know what I mean? Uh, Asher, Judah. Only one? Yep, that's going to be how it goes. Again, when you have a lot of kids, unless I want to buy a truckload of peeps. So, uh, Asher... Judah, Justice is orange. Justice. Eden is going to be this one. Eden. One for you and ten for us. That's right. Um, oh, yeah. I don't have enough to put two, and it's going to be a lot left over. Oh, well. Eden, Solomon, you putting money in the eggs too? There'll be money in the golden ones, which I guess I have my cash register downstairs. I can just do that. Solomon, Sophia, Solomon, Sophia. No, wait a minute. I don't have a dozen kids. I only have nine kids, and Thomas isn't coming. Eight. So I have enough for them to have two. Sophia, Claudia, Hannah. Well, that's awesome, Bella. Let's not get all political in the comments. That happened the other day, and I didn't like it, so this isn't a political channel. 
Um, okay, so back to the top again. Asher. Judah. Justice. Eden. Solomon. Thought about putting Bible verses in the eggs this year. That'd be fun. Kind of a good idea. I'm not going to lie. I, when I, I love the Lord, but when I was a kid, if I opened a, an egg and there was a Bible verse in it, I'd have been sad. Sophia. Claudia. Anna. Okay. Another bag for trash. Okay. Oh, wait, is that a pee peg? Yep, it is. Okay. Okay, the gold ones can go over here to the gold egg section. Thomas isn't going to be here for the Easter hunt. So get rid of those. And then the pastel orange and pink, dark pink. Okay. All right, so now to open up my favorite thing to put in the eggs, Krabby Patties. This has got all the colored Krabby Patties, and I'm not as wild about the colored Krabby Patties, but I guess they don't have these in other countries. So if you know what a Krabby Patty is, you can think like Gummy Bear, except they mix marshmallow in with the recipe. So they're chewier than gummy stuff, but not quite as soury, I guess. I don't know. They're weird. So... Stretchy Easter egg for Judah and Asher. That'd been fun, yeah. They sure loved that thing, didn't they? Okay, where are they going? Okay, let's just put them in here. Asher. Two for Asher. I have a bachelor's. Asher. Judah. Judah. 
adjust this. How many people are hosting Easter versus going somewhere? How many hosters do we have? How many goers do we have? Oh, yeah, I'm making yeast rolls too, and jello eggs, and a jello. I caught a mold, but a rainbow jello y thing. Going, going, traveling, hosting, always the host. It's always fun to be the host. We used to host a lot more things when Andrew was alive, but... Uh, not something that happens anymore now. Except when we have birthday parties and people come over for birthday. Birthdays. Yeah, Krabby Patties are from the cartoon SpongeBob SquarePants. Yep. Although it's just it was just an accident, right? Marshmallow gummy-ish hamburgers have been around a while, but someone decided to add the uh, branding of SpongeBob, and certain didn't hurt hurt it. But that's not why they're popular. I don't think. Maybe it is to some degree. I just think they're the amazing candy. I need to call Asher to bring me some tape, I think. Who hates... I would ask you not answer his phone. No. I could go get it, but then I leave the stream unattended. And that's not a good idea. Thank you. Some of these Krabby Patties are bulging out their containers, so... Uh, 
You found a peel banana stretchy at Kohl's? <laughs> we found that one at Hobby Lobby. I don't know where the original one came from, but... <sighs> Dinner with your dad? That sounds like a great way to spend Easter. It's always interesting to see when things change in a family. I heard someone say it's usually when the grandparents die. Or one, even one grandparent dies. It seems like that's when things change. And I think back in the situations with our family, and we used to go to Grandma Fern's house every year for Christmas, and they'd have a huge shindig. I remember the year I met Andrea. I uh, I was really uncomfortable. I was at somebody else's house I'd never been to before. And, of course, they, Andrea, and all the family were having so much fun talking to everybody. And then uh, I just sat on a couch uncomfortably next to some people I didn't recognize. And over time, just sitting there, none of us is talking to the next person. Everybody's just being quiet. And I realized, I was like, are you guys all boyfriends? And they're like, yep. And I was like, oh, so this is the boyfriend section. There was two couches facing each other, and they were all boyfriends of people that were at the party that were grandkids. And so they uh, they they all took off and left all the boyfriends together. And it was a fun it was a fun memory to think about. I used to change after husband and grandma died. It seems like everybody goes over there. Then, of course, Andrea's grandpa died, and that changed things. You know, they no, they no longer threw big parties with shindigs and all that. And uh, and it was never the same since. But then again, everybody's got to become the grandma and grandpa at some point. I mean, I wonder if I'm ever going to be a grandpa. All right, so old tried and true standby mix with Kit Kat, Reese's, Rolos, and Hershey's and Hershey Kisses. So, let's face it, this is the stuff everybody wants. So, oh yeah, see, I got to take out the gold ones. Is that a gold one? Yeah, gold, 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 gold. I don't need the dark pink. Dark pink we don't need. Don't need metallic blue. Don't need light orange. Okay. I will in time. Yeah, that's what they say. Okay. So let's make sure they all get at least a Reese's. So that's Hannah. I mean, I'm not good at counting backwards. i got to start with Asher. Asher. Reese's. I know Solomon hates Reese's. So I'll make sure he doesn't get any. Uh, Asher. Judah. Justice. That way every kid, a piece of the pie, more shopping on Thursday. <laughs> 52 days apart. Justice Eden. Six, seven years, you may be a grandpa. 
I know people that are grandpa a long time ago. Solomon. Sophia. Claudia. Good to see you, Shelly. Hannah. Okay. Oh, wait. I did a Solomon. I told him he doesn't want Rhesus. Solomon would rather have a Rolo. Heck, he could probably have two Rolos. Okay, back to the front. Asher. Let's get a, a ro couple Rolos in here. Judah. A couple Rolos for him. Justice. A couple Rolos. Why do you drape over basket when why do you drape over basket when done filling them? I don't want the kids to see them before Easter. Easter is not till Sunday, so Eden. Solomon can have a couple more Rolos. See you later, Tracy. Glad you could stay with us. Sophia. A couple more Rolos. Claudia. Okay, back to Asher. This time we'll go with Kit Kat. Judah. Glad you can make it, Melanie. That's my sister's name. Judah Justice. Florida, they're doing a beach egg hunt. The sand is white. The kids' eggs are all excited. That sounds fun. Who did I just do? Must have been Justice. Eden. I don't know if they're going to fit that in here. If they don't fit in here, curse you guys. Not you guys, but the egg makers. All right. So it's supposed to be an egg filling mix. Eden. So if they didn't fit in the eggs, then that would have been the worst egg filling you mix either. The, the light colored eggs are a little bit smaller than the metallic eggs. So in Sophia. Grandparents and uh, my I, my dad does not do nothing. Siblings are always too busy. Kind of boring around the holidays. Yeah, that seems to be when things change. And then if someone else doesn't pick up the reins and fill the gap, and like things break. Solomon, Sophia, Claudia. Thank you, Stacy. Claudia and uh, oh, that goes. That's I did that twice. That's why. 
Yeah, Grandma Kitty should be here. I didn't actually tell her. Mom, if you're watching this, you probably are at some point. Um, come over for morning Easter egg hunting if you want. And then we'll take you over to Amy's. You and Mr. C. Um, Asher. So we'll go with a Crackle. And a Mr. Good Bar. Asher Judah. Uh, my mom is still basically the same, sadly. But she has some things that they're working on. She's trying to get to see another pain doctor. Um, Asher Judah Justice. Eden. That is tight. Eden. Solomon. He'd like a Hershey's and a Crackle, I'm sure. Uh-oh. We got a Crackles? Give him two Hershey's. Oh, there's a crackle. Hershey's and a crackle. Solomon. Sophia. I won't curse anybody with the special dark. You have any idea what's causing her pain? Well, it's almost definitely her pancreas. So there's that, but as to what it is, they're not sure. Sophia, Claudia, Hershey, Hershey. Well, I hope I can get two more candy bars out of that. I shouldn't have put doubled up. Didn't realize how thin they would be. I don't want to give Hannah two special darks. That would be a murder. Okay, let's see. There you go, Mr. Goodbar. That's a special dark. Special dark. Special dark. Hmm. I'll put a couple Hershey Kisses in there. Mr. Goodbar is the best kind anyways. One of my all-time favorite candy bars. Eat those that are your favorite. Oh man, there's always somebody that likes this dark chocolate. Uh. I'm getting there. Oh, my back's killing me. Special dark is just dark chocolate. Just dark chocolate, she says. Dark chocolate is gross. Okay. Gold ones go over here. Thomas is not going to be here. And then... A stent in the pancreas duct, and that could help possibly to have that done. She's got a lot of pain in from her pain in her pancreas. She just starts spasming and hurts. So 
They don't know what it is exactly yet. Okay, so, um, don't need the dark pink ones. And the orange ones. Okay, so, uh, sure. Still have plenty of Reese's left. Did you have gall? Oh, my mom had her gallbladder removed. They thought maybe that was the cause of her pain, but it wasn't. In retrospect, the pain was on the wrong side, but apparently there is an atypical Asher Justice symptom of having gallbladder pain on the wrong side. But yeah, I think chronic pancreatitis is something she has. It basically doesn't go away. Uh, so let's Justice Eden. Solomon. He doesn't want any more Reese's. I'll put a couple Rolos in there. Sophia. Claudia. Thank you, Veronica. I'm probably just going to sit there and veg out. And, uh, Uh, sure. Judah. Justice. Diane can help pancreatitis. My mom has pretty much already cut out all sugar, fats. I mean, she's just barely getting by trying to help. And it does help. Cutting out fatty stuff helps her. But Eden. Sophia. Good to see you, Mustang Sally. Claudia. Hannah. Uh, Asher. Let's start jamming these full. I think we're going to run low on these. So we're going to... Need to get used up more of this candy. Asher, Judah, triple Rolos. Eden. I'm not sure I can get triple Rolos in these girl eggs. Let's see. Nope. How about two rollers and a Hershey kiss? Yeah, that'll work. I need to seal it with some tape. Yeah, I would like a helper, but at the same time, surprise is the whole fun part. Holloman. Sophia. Rolo, Rolo, Hershey Kiss.
Sophia, Claudia. Thomas will will be at, will be at lunch, but he said he wanted to sleep in on uh, Easter morning, so he won't be here for the Easter egg hunt. Homemade tapioca pudding. That's what I love him. I love tapioca pudding. <sighs> Pandry wanted to make me feel really special. She'd make me tapioca pudding. Come home from work and and have me a big Ziploc bag full of tapioca pudding. Asher Shooter. Let's do a Kit Kat. Let's do two Kit Kats. Oh man, that's not gonna go. One Kit Kat and a Rolo. Judah, Justice. We'll do Kit Kat, Rolo, and a, and a couple Hershey Kit. No, that's not gonna work. Find that when he comes over? Yeah, probably not. He won't be into that. And who knows when he'll come over. Uh, Justice. Let's see. Kit Kat. Rolo. Whole bunch of Hershey Kisses. Or she kisses. And you was great at making all the kids feel special. Yes, she was. I'm a little worried about that one. Let's put another hang of tape on it. What are we gonna eat on Easter at Amy's? Huh? Oh, a lot of times they make brisket. Tristan's a really good barbecue guy. Um, Amy's husband. So he might make some brisket or they might make ham. I'll bring uh, rolls um, and jello. Oh, my back. Oh. Ouch. All right, done. Except I gotta fill all the money eggs. I can do that downstairs. I have these bigger. See what I want to do. I can use I can take these golden eggs and stuff them full the rest of the candy. Or I guess I'll just save them and put the those put money in those golden eggs and hide those. The special darks gluten free? No idea. I don't think you can read the ingredients on here. Um where did the these are the rest of the Krabby Patties? So I'll put this rest of this stuff in the B box. 
The directors want our little reward thing. Oh, I've got a purple egg hanging out here still. Claudia was going to be looking all over for a 12th egg. feels weird she is missed that sounds fun Ursula yep I found it and I'm eating it that's what you do to candy under your knee all right guys well I'm pretty much done I'll probably put a couple bucks in each of these no wait they don't need two each i only need eight three two four five six seven eight the rest of these i don't need uh oh i'm spilling So I'll probably put, maybe I'll put a $5 bill. That sounds fun. Kids find five bucks, they'll be so happy. But that's 40 bucks. <laughs> oh, well. Do I even have that many fives? I probably do. I just got change in my register, so. Special dark or gluten-free? Oh. That sounds like a good idea. How about I'll give her, take one of these golden eggs. And put the special darks in there. Perfect. There. Now my mom can have an Easter egg. I'm throwing away these peeps. I don't... Too much sugar in my blood now. I don't... I don't want them. All right. Well, I will see you guys later. Thanks you for hanging out with me and stuffing eggs and baskets and all that. We will see you guys soon now i promised i'll do shopping sometime soon i'm thinking i'm either gonna do it easter uh night what am i kidding i'm not gonna want to do that after i'm all done probably do it on monday so you can expect it next week if you want to see the shopping video so thanks guys i appreciate it like the video we'll see you later